Welcome guys back to the channel, and today here I am with a new series. So do, instead of doing the two list retrospective, like I was doing before with season one, I decided that I was going to take a new direction with this and make it a lot easier on myself. So you, so this is how it goes. So every single day I'll be uploading at least one video. This video will not be a standard five to fifteen, uh, a ten to like twenty minute length video though. It'll be a small three to five minute video of me discussing the episode and then discussing one episode. This one episode will be that one day upload. Then I'll continue on, maybe sometime making two a day, depending on what I have to say about the episode. So yeah, hopefully you enjoy this. That means new content for me, at least one video a day. So please enjoy this review of Thomas and Gordon. From season 1 of Thomas. Season 1, episode 1, Thomas and Gordon. After being fed up with Thomas, after being fed up with Thomas teasing Gordon, he decides to pay him back. My highlight of this episode is a turntable scene. That's really cool. After he has the, after Thomas has the express train on him. Uh, fun fact, this is actually not the first story in the Railway series. The first story is Edward's Day Out, but... The first two stories are actually Edward Zale and Edward Gordon Henry, which you'll see that become important for our next review. Yeah, I think this is a, this is pretty cool. I don't have much to complain about. It's a good pilot episode. It introduces two of our main characters, and arguably the two main characters of the season. So I think overall, what it chooses to do with this episode is nice. The vi it sets the visual style with the pseudo stop motion animation style with the model sets. I think it does it really well. So I think it's pretty obvious what I'm going to rank this episode as. If it isn't obvious what I think of this episode, it's a good episode. The reason I like this episode so much is because of all the stuff in it, the visual style. The story's pretty decent. It's funny in some places. The characters are written really well. It introduces characters that introduces characters, which to me I already knew about these characters. I mean, I've watched this episode before, but even if I haven't watched the episode, I knew about the characters. But this time... Because we're looking at this as a, con as a, a context of being aired in 1984, I think children will be able to understand the story. It doesn't play down to the audience or anything, and overall, this is an amazing way to start the show. Thank you for watching, and enjoy the rest of the